London, Aaron Chalmers knows his background as a reality television star might mean he's never going to be fully taken seriously as a fighter by the armchair MMA fan. But as he prepares to walk out to the Bellator cage for the first time, Chalmers has a simple response to that. FCK them, Chalmers said on Tuesday, after open workouts and ahead of Friday's Bellator 200 event. I'm enjoying this, so I'm going to keep going as far as I can possibly go. But Chalmers, 3-0 MMA, 0-0 BMMA, who meets Ash Griffiths, 4-5 MMA, 0-1 BMMA, in a catchweight main card bout, knows it's not about just enjoyment, it's also about the work. So for his inaugural Bellator appointment, which follows a three-fight unbeaten streak at Bama, he's put in a full 10-week preparation camp. It's been a bit of a different camp, too. Now training in a new jiu-jitsu-focused gym, Chalmers is hoping to show he's got more than hands. It's going to be nice to show everyone a more well-rounded game in the future, hopefully Friday, Chalmers said. Because I think people think I haven't got a ground game, but they're going to get AF King Chalk. The changes are a testament to Chalmers' commitment to a career path that's as recent as May 2017. MMA, Chalmers said, was a hobby when he first took it up, one that he figured would only last a couple of fights. Now that he's left the cast of MTV's England-based reality series, Jordy Shore, though, the 30-year-old Brit is all in. I give everything. Chalmers said, I live in Birmingham, away from my family. Away from my girlfriend. Away from my dog. I take it seriously. I could just train in Newcastle and just be normal, but I literally moved away to a place where I haven't gone many friends apart from gym buddies. I do it the right away and it's paying off. So far, so good for Chalmers, who dispatched his first three opponents in the first round. And while he's now under a larger spotlight with Bellator, in a Paramount televised main card spot airing via same-day tape delay at the SSE Arena in London, the Brit said he tries not to put the big stage pressure upon himself. If anything, the process has actually been a lot more chill. Bellator is a bigger promotion, but for me it's less stress, because you've got so many big names on the card. Chalmers said, You've got Michael Page, Gegard, Musasi, you've got just a whole lot of fighters who are massive in the MMA world. As he presents himself in front of a larger, worldwide audience, Chalmers relishes the opportunity of being seen as a fighter, rather than being judged by his Jordy Shore past. But he doesn't regret having been on the show, where he not only had a great few years traveling the world, but also got the platform he has as a fighter now. When it comes to his MMA career, Chalmers is both ambitious and cautious. As invested as he currently is, he understands he still has ways to go before he even entertains title thoughts. I can happily sit down and say at the minute I'm nowhere near ready for a title fight. Chalmers said. Five years time, if I feel I'm ready, if I feel I can win a title, I can go for it. But I've got a long five years ahead, and I'm going to enjoy every step of he way. But that hasn't stopped Chalmers from thinking about what or who those steps might involve. After his last win, he called out Bellator standout Kevin Ferguson Jr., 3-1 MMA, 3-1 BMMA, baby slice, himself. Informed of Bellator President Scott Coker's interest in that, he was pleased. That's what I'm chasing, Chalmers said, the bigger the shows, the better. I did call out Baby Slice in my last fight. So I've moved one step closer to getting that fight by moving to Bellator. If Scott is saying that, it's looking promising. 
So let's hopefully keep the winning ways and hopefully that fight will come in the future. Another idea currently lies outside Bellator's roster. Although Phil, CM Punk, Brooks' UFC debut wasn't exactly stellar, Chalmers has heard that the former WWE pro wrestling star has come a long way in his training. Punk, 0-1 MMA, 0-1 UFC, now meets Mike Jackson at UFC 225, and Chalmers is keeping an eye on that one. He's big in America, and I'm big in Europe, Chalmers said. It's another one that makes sense. I hope he comes through. I hope he wins. And that's another thing I can look forward to, maybe look forward to in the future. For more on Bellator 200, check out the MMA Rumors section of the site.